My name is Chrissy Ross, and I am the Scholarly Communications Librarian at Steely Library. I've been in this role just over three years now. So open access is the free and immediate access to research articles combined with the rights to use the articles in the digital environment in the name of accelerating research. So there are a lot. Probably the most illustrative right now is related to the pandemic and the effort of researchers around the world to open up their data and their research in the name of accelerating a vaccine and therapies. Um, they are doing this explicitly and removing their research from behind expensive paywalls in the name of saving lives. Now think about if we applied this idea to all research, how, how quickly we could solve societal problems and um, you know, cure disease and, and, and all of that. So I think you know, there's a lot of places that open access is very important and I think um, public health maybe is just a very um, clear um, positive benefit from open access research. So as students learn to become researchers, they should advocate with their mentors when they are publishing to seek out open access journals and open publishing models. Students are in a great place to educate and advocate for open access with not only their mentors, but also their peers, all in the name of progressing society and accelerating innovation. So that is a great question. Open access fundamentally is a social justice movement. It addresses information privilege and who should have access to taxpayer funded um, data and research. And spoiler alert, everybody should have access to it. So let's make that happen and get involved. Norse up. <laughs>